morning. The wind is just howling here like never seen before. Yeah, but keep going. Keep the challenge. Then Kilimanjaro is the deal. Yeah. clearing agent to facilitate the process of crossing the border and uh, if everything goes as planned we may be able to cross the other side of TZ the Tanzanian side and uh, yes we'll keep you posted as usual so far from uh, Nairobi to this point here it took us uh, approximately two hours to three hours to the this slow Lopez, things so far so good, everything is go as well. And this I think is uh, among the international border points which connects Tanzania to Kenya on this, uh, this side. There's another border point of now from um, Orohoro, which is um, the, from Tanga, Orohoro to Mombasa. This is now from uh, Tanzania via Arusha to Nairobi. Fantastic, so far so good. Uh, and we're gonna see whether if after crossing we may sleep on the side of Tanzania or if uh, we find a little bit of hiccups we may decide to sleep on the Kenyan side at Namanga one stop one stop over border point thanks for watching let us meet on the next episode bye my name is Nouris Melozol, diesel engineer, filmmaker, storyteller. Join me as I share my passion for building trucks and traveling to the magical places in the world. Adventure of a lifetime, at least once in a lifetime. Welcome to the show, and here we are. This is a Nairobi city center. And here, as you can see, there it's Uganda house. We go. Yesterday, as you uh, you saw the last part of the episode, you name it. We had a little bit of the hiccups at the border point. One stop border challenge. What we name it, one stop, one stop border challenge at Namanga border point. Guess what happened? We had two passports with the two TMP, as we name ourselves as usual, East Africans. We thought it's as usual, but that was not the case. And this is the man who made all this to be thumbs up, upside down. Say something the viewer what happened you reach Namanga and after that out after sudden you had a colossal detour back to Nairobi city what could be the problem the viewers wanted to know uh, tell them the problem was, and the problem is we are not in East Africa <laughs> we are in divided East Africa we are yet to enter East Africa we had the TMP which we got from uh, for one of our uh, two colleagues. Yeah. 
Nairobi and Sadir did her passports. We traveled the whole way from Busia to Nairobi. Nairobi to Damanga. No problem at all. Um, as soon as we reached uh, the Tanzanian side, we presented documents. They said no. These documents uh, are not in the East African uh, agreement. <laughs> they are null and, vi null and void. Null it, and void. It was been nullified. <laughs> so they asked, do you have a certificate of Manga Manga? Because this is in Manga. We said, did we we start in Manga Manga? So we started Manga Manga <laughs> back to Nairobi. So that's what, that's the reason why we are here. Yeah. By now we should have been in Moshi actually. Yeah, sure. But then because of that challenge, we had to come back to our consulate in yeah. uh, Nairobi, and we are successfully. Uh, we are successful. almost there. We already have it. Just a matter of time. Yes, sign. So that's what happened. And as you know, usually the, the, the expedition we must we always have challenge. challenges. Hiccups. Yeah? So we are still enjoying it as well. So we talk about the man behind the wheel, behind the steering, behind this whole story. Yeah. What is your emotional, currently emotional, of yesterday's night, you even forgot to capture that moment? Well, of um, that emotion. This thing reminds me of a Karamoja trip. You know, those boys that lost their cows. You can you can relate from the video, yeah? yeah. Uh, that was how the guy cried his cows. So I think at that point when uh, they said no to us because we didn't have the passports, we also fell in the same situation and uh, we almost cried in the same manner that Karamojong cried. How did he cry? Eh? Yeah. My brother knows best <laughs> how he... <laughs> <laughs> so that is also a learning curve to you guys. Make sure we prepare ourselves. Um, whenever you actually, you know, taking on yeah. uh, such journey, uh, make sure you have your passport. Really? It should be a valid, yeah, not an expired one. Yeah. Because that will get you into bigger problems than uh, what we went through. But uh, we thank God uh, we came back to Nairobi City and right now we are almost done with the issue, just waiting for one signature and uh, from this point we'll just sign out back to Namanga. We hope we don't Manga Manga again. Manga Manga again. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so say something, your emotional first time yesterday. At that night, how was your feeling though, to be deported back to where you belong? My feeling was just the, camera. just the same as the one for the men in Karamoja, as he said. People were almost crying. I saw him. His face was not norm, not like the normal way it is. It used to be. It used to be. Uh -huh. So we just came back here to Nairobi to get some papers which they needed. Now we are waiting for some more signature and then we take off. Okay, so far so good. To remind you that we are determined to give you all the best. The general behind the wheel, we left Nairobi at 7 o'clock, we are in Namanga by 9 and we, he managed to make a return. Colossal U-turn. <laughs> he managed to make a return and by, by, by half past midnight we were in Nairobi. So that shows how determined we are to accomplish Africa. You have no idea. 1027. Yeah, around 1027. Yes. So this is how determined we are to go and fetch for you whatever is up there in Kili. The opera named Operation Africa Rooftop and then the grassroots. Yeah, who ni wungwana wana tizi. Kweli munasema toko katika Africa mashariki sisi wote. Sasa, tuambie hiyo ni ungwana. Je, huu ni ungwana. And then I give you one one dangerous bit about Nairobi. It is a town that you can be driven. In Africa, the most reckless riding experience you like never seen in any part of this barrel of Africa. And the traffic is our conductors. Guys, I think uh, almost there. We're just waiting for some one signatory to give on that uh, paper, temporary permit in more. It's the same thing, same term, temporary migration. 
Okay. Movement, movement permit. Movement permit. It's just same thing, just because it is shorter, the one the, a, a bit larger. Elaborated one. Elaborated one. So we have no idea, we, have, we had no choice just to wait and until the time it will be gonna be officially released back on our truck, back to Namanga Road, back to the challenge of Tanzanian challenge. But yeah. we're gonna challenge them, guys. They will not manage. Also, they talked about, oh, we need to cover. What's coming? I've never had this kind of complication things. Oh, we need to cover those headlamps, everything. We need to cover this as well. So we have to drive blindly, is what they say. But I said, we're gonna challenge them. If they want, we can just disconnect the light. So if you want, they just cut here with the scissor. As long as we have another tape there, we can just reconnect it, we plug it back as usual. So we're gonna, this is the remaining challenge we anticipate to have it there. But so far, so good, everything is as planned. We just finished our, 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 our lunch. Just uh, wait because they promise us at around the 2.30, they'll be able to release us officially and to hit the rock. And this is the Alton C, Nairobi City Center called Kenyatta Avenue, Main. Yeah, maybe you're gonna have a little bit of a round to give you a little bit of a details, the surround of this city. But be careful always, Nairobi with the, I don't know if it also the, the truck guys, the buses guys, or the, the, the or it's only the, 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 the motorcyclists. The reckless, even I tried to stop, remember that guy. When he tried, the traffic man stopped me but the border border guy said, here in Nairobi is a policy. Never stop when you see traffic stop you. I was surprised. What? More here to come. Stick with us.
My name is Nuri Ismail Nozul, diesel engineer, filmmaker, storyteller. Join me as I share my passion for building trucks and traveling to the magical places in the world. And remember to hit that notification bell to Even make sure that you catch up our weekly series of videos. Adventure of a lifetime. At least once in a lifetime.